Hi everyone, this is Joanna and tonight I have come back with a small haul for the Amazon mail that I got yesterday, um, December the 31st. Um, and I know there's no mail running today and the reason I'm doing this video today because I was going to do it tomorrow was I'm not sure if I'm going to get any items tomorrow besides a nail stamping plate that I am waiting for from Mo U London which is a Capricorn plate. Some things may come but for the most part everything else that I believe um, that I had ordered from them stated that I would get it later in January so we will see but this was the first thing now this didn't come yesterday um, this came I believe a few days before that I just kept forgetting to show it and I believe I got six of these in here I think six because I pulled the one that I had left that I was keeping these are the cheeky pads that you've heard me say that I like um, the ones that I got when I got down to this last thing right here, this is what they look like. And these are smooth on both sides. I probably haven't shown these in a while. Now they'll still come apart. I mean, if you're rough with them or your plate is, you know, thickly etched or whatever, but they don't come apart right away. They don't roll up and make a lot of lint versus um, the ones that I have like this. And this is a used one from last night. These are smooth as well and they kind of look like this on the surface but they come apart they don't clean real good they've got this line like right here and and you can see I can pull that apart and this is what's on the inside of there I don't like these I think I got those when I was trying to save these these right here are etched around there like that they're just better I like these a lot better and when I got down to that last roll I was really trying to hold on to them you can use these for makeup it says it on the pack um, I don't. I don't even use these to remove my nail polish. I use cotton balls. But it says on here that you can use it for nail polish and lipstick, foundation, makeup. Um, ideal for applying lotions and toners. Um, astringents. I don't know about the oils. Now I probably would use these as um, face toner pads because I think they would be ideal for that. And then the next thing that I got, and when I opened this and took it out of the bubble wrap, it looked like this on the side so hopefully it's okay you see that glare like they got it up against something and I didn't open it up I just took the bubble wrap off of it and it does look like it is supposed to look and I got these for nail stamping the only one I had was the blue one and this color let's see if it's on here is called yellow gold and I believe I ordered another one that was the one that I couldn't remember if I ordered green or purple. I'll have to look on there and see. Because I have been um, archiving the things that have came so that I know what I'm waiting for. And I'm still waiting on some nail studs, some nail plates. The nail plates, I will tell you, are the Moyu London ones. And I believe they are the face plates. I don't know if I order two or three but one of them is the face with the dragon and the other one is the face with the sword and I don't have mine out to tell you what the numbers are but I also have one of my other favorites from the Suki collection and they're both from the Suki collection the one that I have is a number one that one with the owl so I'm gonna be having a giveaway um, I don't know yet if I'm gonna have a giveaway with all three plates or if I'm gonna do one of each I don't know that yet but I wanted to wait until my latest giveaway items were received and she has received those and I was very worried about that because that was my very first international shipment I have ordered things from the United Kingdom and from the Netherlands and all that before but I have never shipped anything off so it was received safely but I was very scared and I definitely learned a lot there were things I didn't even know existed or that I had to do so that was definitely a learning experience for the better so this looks like it's supposed to look except for this and I plan to stamp with this and I don't know if I'll do that on here or not because since I got those new CC and sissy plates that could be an excuse for me to stamp but I keep saying that I feel like those are too thickly etched but there are a few thin designs and I do have the new Queen celebration and DRK lace nails coming. I think that plate is called something else, the DRK one. I'm calling it lace nails. 
because it's got a lot of lace on there. So maybe I'll hold off and do the stamping demonstration with this with those plates because I think they're more finely etched. Also, the only other two things that I got, well one actually, and I was trying to think, oh, because of Miss Nail Stamp for Fun, I learned of Sugar Bubbles plates and because of her I want some but I got on there they were sold out of the ones that I wanted but I do want a few of those so thanks to her I now know about plates called sugar bubbles YouTube gets me every time because if I didn't look for things I wouldn't know about things to buy also I got this plate because of Miss Allie I believe she's called nice nails 219 she did a very cute gradient with this plate and I had just ordered um, that batch of plates that I ordered from Born Pretty Store, my very first order, and I haven't used any of those. I have got to stop sticking things in boxes because I cleaned up for Christmas, cleaned my table off, and now I don't know where anything is. But I do want to use this, and I got this plate because of her tutorial. And it's very pretty, but now there's a ton of other plates that I like that they make. And I think they gave me this one for free because I did not order this. And this is very cute. And all of these will fit on the nail. I have no complaint. And maybe even two. But the little deer, the little house I really like. Here's a Santa face. These little snowflakes are cute, especially for the pinky when you want little bitty snowflakes. The candy cane, the snowman, a bell. And this is QA19. And I believe they sent it to me for free. And this one is Born Pretty 10, I guess, from the BP10. And that is all that I got for that. If I get anything else tomorrow, I will definitely record it. And this kind of packaging right here, I'm going to start holding on to, especially because I'm going to be doing another nail stamping plate giveaway. And I don't know yet. I hate to do a nail stamping plate giveaway and not um, include a stamper and a scraper and possibly a polish because I mean the only way that I probably wouldn't is if it's someone who already has those items but I still like to send those items out with those things so I don't know yet I am willing to listen to any suggestions if you have any but I do know I'm going to go back and make sure. I will either have three or four plates, um, and I do know that three of them are definitely Suki plates. The one that I have, the two that I'm waiting for, and I don't remember if I ordered a third or not. Like I said, I'm going to have to get on there and see, but my goal is to start trying to clear some things out. Long story. I'm going to stop that. Anyway, I want everyone to have a good night. And if you have any suggestions um, on if you think I should do the plates, you know, all together or one at a time, just let me know and it'll be open to all my subscribers. Um, so until the next time, everyone have a great night.